Qualcomm's massive booth at the Mobile World Congress was certainly not one to be missed. The highlight of the company's showcase was the brand new Snapdragon 835 chipset. It's a powerful new processor that's set to power Android phones in the coming months. But as of now, it's made its debut on the Sony Xperia XZ Premium. Qualcomm had its prowess on full display at MWC, showing off demos of various technologies and innovations powered by their processor. You know, in this day and age, security across mobile platforms and all other digital platforms has become a necessity. And Qualcomm is also doing a lot to beef up security across all platforms. I've got a demo for you. Take a look. So what we're going to see is a new concept technology from Qualcomm Technologies. We call it Qualcomm ID and it's all about secure mobile identity, mobile identity that's secure and private. Very exciting thing and let me show you how it works. The beauty of it is that you don't need to make any changes to IDs or government infrastructures and it's all entirely offline. So here's how it goes. First thing, I have my Qualcomm ID device. This is a device that supports the technology. And all I need is a government issued document, like a passport, that supports a global standard called e-passport, electronic passport. Passports that have the, this icon are essentially compatible for more than 100 different countries. I'm going to enroll my passport. This is something I do once. I can do it at home safely and securely. Enroll the passport into the phone, so I'll go ahead and do that. First thing I do is I take a photo of the ID on the passport. Okay, we're again in this reading the passport. Okay, and now my passport has been read, the information is inside, I'm going to approve that. And we can only reach this point if this is a genuine, authentic, government-issued passport because we are verifying the digital signature in the passport. This is something only the government has access to, so this is the real deal, this is the real passport. Now I can keep my passport safely in a safety deposit box at home and I can use the device wherever I am to identify myself. Let's see what the service provider has to do in order to support this technology. Really, really easy. All they have to do is use an Android device that has NFC, could be any device. They download a compatible application. In this case, it's called the Checker application. And the first time they do it, they have to select their business profile. We have a bar profile here, we have a flight check-in profile. Let's just choose this one for the demonstration. And we're gonna call in our bartender. Here you go. And now what I wanna do is prove to the bartender that I am legal drinking age so that he can serve me a drink. But I wanna keep my passport away, I'm not holding it with me, and I wanna make sure that the bartender knows nothing about me except that he can serve me the drink. So I enter my own app, choose uh, the bar scenario, and now we just tap our devices one against the others. Okay, and what the bartender sees is my face and an indication signaling that I'm at least 21 years old. He can serve me the drink, he knows nothing about me, not my name, nationality, ID number, uh, safe transaction, very private, very secure.